at various places and at various times, God has been pleased to bring about awakenings. And in all of those movements in history, at the very center was an awakening to the power and truthfulness of the Scripture itself. The Reformation Study Bible is at the end of a long line of work. All of these streams, they're pouring into the destination of enabling you as a reader to sit down with God's Word and to understand that in a way that is crisp, in a way that is fresh, in a way that brings God's Word to bear on the life that you live today. I don't just appreciate it. I use it myself all the time, and I'm extremely grateful. It saves me time, and I find that if I go and read six or seven commentaries on a given passage, that I see a real continuity. It's like having an entire seminary and library at my side. A design is more than aesthetics. It is a thought process. When somebody can fully experience and engage in something like the Reformation Study Bible from a reading perspective and not even consider the design, then we've done our job. The light of the Reformation was the light of the Bible. Our prayer is that the Lord would use this resource to equip His church. Great care has been taken in the way in which the notes are presented and the text presented. This is really a community of scholars working together to arrive at that crystallized expression that would be the most helpful for readers. Just like the Reformers would have wanted, just like they sought to take the depths of the theology of Scripture and distill it so that people could understand it. This study Bible gives to readers an in-depth experience, but it does so in giving that to them in a simple and clear way. And overseeing that entire process is Dr. Sproul. And as the study Bible comes together, it reflects that fidelity to the historic Reformed faith that has marked Dr. Sproul's ministry for these last four decades. When Jesus prayed in the upper room, for his disciples, he prayed for their sanctification. Father, sanctify them by thy truth. Thy word is truth. Where the scripture is studied deeply and ingested into the bloodstream of people, that's the power that God uses to awaken the church and move beyond revival to reformation. That's the intention. And that's the single purpose of the Reformation Study Bible. We call this book the Reformation Study Bible. What we want to see happen is a Bible study reformation.